Hey, Wilson family. We hope you've enjoyed 2019 at Wilson, and we want to make 2020 even better. We've noticed a problem that has come up, and we'd like to address it together with you here today. Lunch breaks. Normally, students eat in their designated areas, the sixes and sevens on the bleachers in the gym, and the eights in the foyer. And then for lunch activities, students have the option to either go outside for break or stay in the gym. Here are the issues. Most kids eat in the gym, and it can be super loud and stressful for kids who just want a quiet place to eat. We've noticed garbage is not being thrown out, particularly on the brand new bleachers we've just installed. Most students are staying in the gym and supervision is getting tougher, with more kids not listening. Some students are leaving the gym through the side door, which means they walk through an area outside of teacher supervision, and that leads to problems when kids try to hang out there. Some students aren't choosing the gym or outside, but try to go back and forth, which means they're trying to walk in an unsupervised area on purpose. We're discovering that incidents are happening more frequently inside and outside of the school. Here's what we want for our students. A safe and quiet place to eat their lunch. For kids to take ownership of their school and take care of it. To have fewer kids in each zone. To always be in the line of sight of our supervising teachers so that far fewer incidents are occurring. We'd like to introduce a new lunch rotation schedule. Here's how it works. For the eating portion of lunch, students will be in their grade level zones. Zone one is in the classroom, zone two is the common area, and zone three is the gym. Each grade will have two weeks in each zone and then they will rotate. Starting January 6th, the grade sixes will be in their classrooms, the grade sevens in the gym, and the grade eights in the common area. After two weeks, we will announce the new rotation and we will post it on the TVs as well. Remember, this is just for the eating portion of lunch. There will be microwaves in each zone. The cafeteria will still be open, but when the bell rings, students will go outside. In zone one, students will eat their lunch in the classrooms. Students are responsible for cleaning up after themselves, which means throwing all garbage away and wiping off their desk. When the bell goes, they will exit the correct door. Grade sixes and sevens will exit through door one, which is the nearest to the staff parking lot. Grade eights will exit through door three, the north gym door close to the band room. Door two is reserved for people leaving the common area. In zone two, the common area, students will eat their lunches at the round tables and go outside through door two straight down the hall. In zone three, the gym, Students will eat their lunches on the bleachers and pick up any garbage and toss it in the correct place. When the bell goes, only these students will have the option to stay in the gym or to go outside through door three. Students need to decide beforehand what their choice is because once you stay in the gym or go outside, you need to remain there for the rest of lunch. We'd also like to let you know that for this new schedule, we will not be able to go outside to the courtyard anymore. We want to limit the outside zone to just the north field. Remember, the north field for us ends in an imaginary line. The imaginary line goes from the corner of the school, where the band room is, to the baseball backstop. Do not cross it. Also remember that we will not be opening the side gym door anymore because there shouldn't be any kids in this unsupervised zone please go through the correct door when you go outside for lunch. It is our hope that this new schedule rotation helps bring a calm to Wilson lunch breaks and that kids feel safe and get a good, healthy break. We want what is best for our students. So thanks for hearing us out. Let's make 2020 the best year yet.